I'm elected president. A total and complete shutdown of we do degenerates entering the United States. You have to take out their families. Citizens against weebs. Super PAC is responsible for the content of this advertising. Despite its impressive length, it's a nimble navigator, and some can be highly venomous. I only tell the truth, lobbyists. Just like the tarantula it's killing, the centipede has two curved hollow fangs, which inject paralyzing venom. Yeah, maybe get this the centipede remnants out. out. Out, out, out! You admonish. It's Rubio! Mom, my mom is the strongest woman I know. She should this be running. out of balance. You can hear that from the other candidates. They don't say anything anyway. There used to be consequences. There are none anymore. So that's it. All right, thank you very much. Wow. Well, I want to apologize for her. No, I won't right do now. that because I said nothing wrong. Go ahead. Go no. ahead. Don't get nervous. You can't stop the Trump. Oh no. This looks bad, lads. Will this finally stump the Trump? Oh, it's nothing. Someone must answer for this failed attempt to stump the Trump. Holy shit. You're fired. Screw you! You're fired! You're fired! You're fired. 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 Don't bother coming home, Ben Shapiro. We changed the locks on our doors. Mr. Trump just arrived in Chicago and after meeting with law enforcement has determined that for the safety of all the tens of thousands of people that have gathered in and around the arena, tonight's rally will be postponed until another day. Thank you very much for your attendance and please go in peace. Please go in peace. Seem to be calming down, getting more peaceful, but at the same time, you know, this is this is something that these protesters were hoping to do tonight, and they seem to have gotten what they wanted. At this point, I can tell you that we have seen pockets of, of law enforcement. protesters were violent, uh, they were swinging, they were hitting people.
what, folks? We're going to take our country back from these people. We're going to take it back. These are bad, bad people. not let them intimidate you. You back this man right here to the hill. They will say anything. Any candidate is responsible for the culture of the campaign. They will do anything to keep in power, okay? You create an environment that only encourages this sort of nasty discord. You think I had such an easy life. What do I need this for, right? How do I do? You know why I need it? Because I've done great. I love this country. We're going to make our country great again. I owe. It's payback time. It's payback time. Surely, such a riot will be what finally, finally, finally stumps the Trump. Pack it in, lads. The show is over. But we begin our second hour today with the results from Super Tuesday 2, the first ones. Donald Trump notches his first win of the day in the Mariana Islands. Welcome. A huge win we project for Donald Trump in Florida. Donald Trump will win all 99, all 99 delegates. Winner take all in Florida. CNN projects Donald Trump is the big winner in Florida tonight. Huge win for Donald Trump. Foolish little foam boy. You thought you could stomp the Trump? Where uh, it is so, so crucial. And in Florida right now, we can comfortably say as polls close that Donald Trump has beaten Marco Rubio in his home state. <laughs> It's 8 o'clock on the East Coast, which means polls have now closed in three more states, including the crucial state of Florida, where Fox News projects that Donald Trump will easily beat Florida Senator Marco Rubio in that state. <laughs> we have a race call. Fox News can now project that Donald Trump will defeat Ted Cruz in the Illinois Republican presidential primary, according to Fox exit polls and early vote tallies. Just because we want to show you what has happened in North Carolina, Fox News is projecting that Donald Trump has won North Carolina right now. You can see that on your screen. And people are very frustrated. It really began back in 2007, 2008, Marco! with this horrifying downturn. While it is not God's plan that I be president in 2016, or, or maybe ever, and while today my campaign is suspended, no. the fact that... Corey, good job, Corey. Good job. You will call up Terry. The president. I guess I have to do it myself. It's Rubio. Oh. 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 Oh.